Welcome back. In this session, we will do the exploration of commands for Microsoft 365 licenses and teams using the Microsoft Graph PowerShell module. In the dynamic landscape of enterprise environments utilizing Microsoft 365 services, administrators face the ongoing challenge of efficiently managing licenses, application registrations, and teams. The Microsoft Graph PowerShell module comes to the rescue, providing a robust set of commands to facilitate these critical administrative tasks. Our primary goal is to streamline and automate administrative tasks related to Microsoft 365 licenses, application registrations, and Teams. This comprehensive objective entails the identification of available modules, exploration of commands tailored to licenses, application registrations, and Teams, and ultimately, the practical utilization of these commands for effective management within the enterprise environment. In this session, we are going to perform four simple tasks. Task 1, Identify and List Modules. Our journey begins with the essential task of identifying and listing the Microsoft Graph PowerShell modules currently available. We'll use the Find Module command, specifically searching for modules with names starting with Microsoft Graph. The result will be a clear display of the identified modules, setting the foundation for further exploration. Next task 2, Explore License Commands. Moving on to license management, our focus shifts to exploring commands related to Microsoft 365 licenses using the Git command Conglet. To streamline our search, we'll filter commands containing license in their names. The ultimate goal is to retrieve a comprehensive list of available commands, empowering administrators to efficiently manage Microsoft 365 licenses. After exploring license commands, we will proceed further and perform. Task 3. Investigate Application Registration Commands Here we will dive into the world of application registrations in Microsoft 365. Leveraging the git command Comdlet, we'll strategically filter commands containing application in their names. The outcome will be a detailed list of available commands, providing administrators with the tools they need to effectively manage application registrations within the Microsoft 365 environment. At last, we will explore commands for team that is. Task 4, Explore Teams Administration Commands. Our exploration extends to Microsoft Teams Administration. Using the git command Comdlet, we will identify commands containing team in their names. This focused approach will result in a concise list of available commands, equipping administrators with the necessary tools for streamlined and effective Teams administration. After completion of all these tasks, you will follow the same pattern to explore any of the graph resources using PowerShell. Now let's jump to Visual Studio Code and write the code for all these four tasks. Let's first create a file called ExploreCommand.ps1. Task 1, Module Discovery. For this we will write, Find Module Microsoft, Graph Asterisk, Select Object Name. Task 2, License Management. For Task 2 we will write, Git Command Module Microsoft, Graph Asterisk License. Task 3, License Management. For Task 3 we will write, Git Command Module Microsoft, Graph Asterisk Application. Task 4, License Management. For Task 4, we will write Git Command Module Microsoft, Graph Asterisk Team. Now let's execute all the tasks one by one. So to execute Task 1, select the line number 3 and right click and select Run Selection or press F8. I selecting Run Selection option. Now you will notice that it has given us all the command for Microsoft Graph resources. Next, we will run task 2 to get all the command for license management. So to execute task 2, select line number 7, right click and select run selection. Now you will notice that it has given us all the command of Microsoft Graph to manage licenses. First, we will clear the console. Next, we will run task 3 to get all the command for application registration. So to execute task 3, select line number 12, right click and select run selection. 
now you will notice that it has given us all the command of Microsoft Graph to manage application registration. Again here we will clear the console first, next we will run task 4 to get all the command for Teams administration. So to execute task for select line number 16 right click and select run selection. Now you will notice that it has given us all the command of Microsoft Graph to manage Teams administration. Just a quick heads up for our PowerShell adventures with Microsoft Graph. When it comes to extracting commands, remember this golden rule. If you want to pull out any command from Microsoft Graph and PowerShell, follow this pattern. It's the secret sauce for navigating through Microsoft Graph's powerful commands effortlessly. Keep it handy and happy extracting. On this note, I am stopping over here. See you in the next session.